Then this one is a team-based deduction card game where no one really knows who is on their side because there's going to be a few different roll cards offered in this game. There is the dark panda and then there are the light panda and then there could be a number of infected panda depending on player count. But these roll cards are all going to be paired with a resource with the exception of the dark panda who's going to get paired with a infected card. And then each of those pairs of cards are going to be randomly dealt to each of the players. Game plays up to six rounds and the light panda will win if they're able to locate and kill the dark panda, but the dark pandas win if that sixth round is completed. Players also have the opportunity to add tokens to a central board and also add cards into their backpack, and the cards and tokens do come in light and dark, and either team could win the game early if one of their members gets enough cards in their backpack and tokens in the central board matching their color. But during a round, players are going to be taking turns drawing two resource cards and one effect card into their hand. And they're going to be choosing one of those resource cards to reveal face up on your own personal player board. And they're going to be choosing another card to put face down on one of the other players. Once all of this is done, each player is going to decide whether to accept or reject both of the cards on their board. If they accept, they're going to be looking at that face down card and then adding both of their cards into their backpack. But if that face down card was an infect card, then they're going to be joining the Dark Pandas team. If they chose to reject the cards, then they're going to be discarding both of them without looking at the face down card but they're also going to be adding a token to the central board depending on what that face up card was. This could result in a light, dark, or kill token being added to the central board. During this time, players can also use one of their effect cards to do all sorts of different abilities like looking at the top two cards of another player's backpack or even manipulating the location of various cards or making a card act like a different card. Players are going to be trying to get certain types of cards into their backpack not only to win the game but also to try and kill the other players because if a player has five of the same type of resource in their backpack, they can discard those cards to issue a kill on another player, but this can only happen after round three. The kill tokens in the central board also act as a shared wild resource, so if you don't have enough of a particular resource in your backpack, you can also discard those tokens from the central board to issue that kill. When a player is killed, they reveal their character card, but they don't reveal anything from their backpack. Then the game continues like this until either player wins by getting enough tokens and cards into their backpack, or by killing the Dark Panda, or by getting to the end of that sixth round. Check out the campaign in the description down below.